So this building here offers a little bit of a taste of what the red bricks of the old asylum over Brook is actually like. It's lived for more than a century. After a long life of tears, heartache, and darkness, a North Jersey icon will soon be laid to rest. Dark skies set the mood for my chase with Wheeler and Tabinez at the old Overbrook Asylum in Cedar Grove. This way to hell. He recently released this book called The Old Asylum and Other Stories, and this comes as the former mental hospital will soon be demolished. Wheeler talks about how this landmark and haunted attraction has made an impact in his life. The old asylum may be gone forever, but I never left the shadow of the buildings. Wheeler grew up roaming the grounds of this former mental hospital and is devastated that it's being demolished. He says it's a piece of history, but he also acknowledges that it speaks to a very sore part of New Jersey's history. And he shares this exclusive video inside the asylum before the state blocked it off. It's just been my whole life I've, I've spent here. I grew up here, literally. Um, for others, it'll be a legacy of madness and pain. The hospital used to house those being treated for tuberculosis and also mental illnesses. And this came at a time when mental illness was often misunderstood and mistreated. It was sort of shameful the way we dealt with mentally ill patients back then. And I think they want to move on from that, which I understand. They're knocking down a lot of really great history, you know, interesting history, fascinating stuff, but I get it. For him, this was his life. It was his livelihood. You could just see him taking it all in. Ah, it's a sad day. Well, thank God this is coming down. I mean, so many kids go there and voyage through there, and the more they fall, the more they want to go. I wonder if they thought about selling it and creating a, a revenue generator, like a museum. It would be more like money to actually try to renovate it, because inside, he says, it's, it's a mess. A lot of the time, people go in and strip everything, too. If there's any metals, if there's right. anything going on, they take it, they, take it, it, they yeah, go and scrap it. it. All right. Thanks, Ashley. This way to hell.